could one officer shoot another? Tonight, we talk with a former training officer and police academy chief to weigh in on what happened. Crown Forest Dan Kerman has our report. University of San Francisco Senior Public Safety Director Daniel Lawson is a retired San Francisco police captain who was in charge of the police academy for five years. We asked him how the shooting of BART Police Sergeant Tom Smith could happen. The two circumstances in which, which friendly fire uh, results in, a, in injury or death uh, is when um, there's possibly a, um, a, a mistake made, um, a accidental discharge, uh, or in a situation where an officer mistakenly perceives uh, the threat uh, from another officer. Lawson says BART cops get the same training as officers at any city police department. He also says it's not unusual for non-SWAT officers like Sergeant Smith and the others to conduct a probation search. But if that's going to happen, he says there must be pre-planning. Knowing the location you're going into, being able to know what you're, each, each other is going to do once you get in there. One officer goes to this room, another officer is going to go to the, this, this area, another officer is going to go here. You're going to communicate with each other verbally or with hand signals. Lawson says even if that planning happened, what was to be routine turned out not to be once the officers found the suspect's door unlocked. That alone may justify the officer to believe that there may be a threat, that there could possibly be a threat in there, and that, that it would justify them in, in taking their firearms out, although keeping them at a, uh, a position that was a safe position pointed to the ground. And Lawson says with the threat level heightened, mistakes can happen. When you're in there and, um, and, you, and an officer perceives that there's a threat, Firearms have been drawn, and one officer might lose track of the other officers and then maybe startled or um, see out of the corner of his or her eye uh, a, sh a quick movement with a gun. A quick, a quick decision has to be made. And, um, and unfortunately in this case, and I don't know if those were the circumstances or not, but unfortunately in this case, somebody was shot and killed. Dan Kerman, Cron 4 News.